until you meet all of our friends we have out here on the back lot. This morning, it's time for Adoptable Dogs. Today, we're talking about reducing our pet's foot paw print. And of course, we have pet trendologist Charlotte Reed. We're going to talk to you in just a minute. As always, John Van Zanti from the Rancho Coastal Humane Society is here to talk about these guys. These are great. First time I ever met you, you told me that you grew up with Cocker Spaniels. We didn't know we'd be out here with you Barney. this morning, but we brought yes. Cocker Spaniels. Barney. So. And he was a gold uh, Cocker Spaniel. Cocker Spaniel. So really, really great dogs. And we have uh, two of them here. Robin's got the very first one on the outside. That is Kenya. She's a 10-year-old, 28-pound Cocker Spaniel. Uh, she and Luke came from the same family. They can go together, but they don't necessarily have to go together. Uh, Robin tells me Kenya gives kisses and is very social and loves to snuggle and sit on your lap for you. And then uh, also on the other side is Luke, a seven-year-old, 36-pound Cocker Spaniel. Uh, and really, to be honest, they could both use a, a few less treats and a little more exercise. They were Look at those faces <laughs> right there. Transferred to Rancho Coastal Humane Society. Robin, they love you. They do. Well, Robin's a foster failure. She just adopted the, the dog that she was fostering. Ah. In home. <laughs> so, but uh, transferred to us through the fo focus program. And then Maria has Luna, a five-month-old, 21-pound. We're calling her a palm ski, the lady that bought her from a pet store. And they got home and found out she couldn't have a dog. Uh, uh, when she bought her, she was told it was a Pomeranian Husky. Look at how well trained Luna oh, is. Well, it's it's well trained on the treat that Maria is holding in her hand. But uh, just got to Rancho Coastal Humane Society. Only five months old. Five months old. Will be available for the first time starting at 11 o'clock this morning. Now the adoption fee includes the medical exam, spay neuter vaccinations, microchip, and the Rancho Coastal Humane Society is in Encinitas and open from Wednesday through Monday, 11 to 5. And the phone number. We've got on your screen. Now let's talk about reducing your carbon paw, paw print. print. Charlotte, good morning to good you. Good morning. Who do we have right here? This is not my available dog. for adoption. Not available for adoption, but this is my dog Ty, which I rescued. And actually, Ty is lying on this great Pendleton collection. Pendleton, you know, as you know, they have, they're about 153 years old, and they teamed up with Carolina Pet to produce this wonderful collection of. Um, products, which is beds and water bowls and portable bags. And what's really nice is that part of the proceeds from the parks collection, because this year we're celebrating a hundred years, the centennial anniversary of the National Parks collection, and proceeds from this collection that people buy will go to help the National Park Service. So we're thinking about the environment and our pets are helping us. Got it. So one of the ways we can reduce our pets' carbon paw print is through products that then in turn uh, help, help to the reduce. Environment and our natural majesty. Now, are there some natural things that we can do right now with our pets to reduce Absolutely. that paw print? Well, one of the things that we find is that cats, cats are so popular right now, but cat litter is really detrimental to the environment. There's about two million pounds of clay litter in landfills across the country. So I always tell people to go with something that's natural. So think of, for example, Oka Cat, which you can feel it. It's really soft. It's made with wood pulp and other resources, renewable resources. And what's nice about it is, unlike your wheat or your corn litter, because it's not a food product, it has natural antibacterial qualities. And what's also nice, it's absorbent, it's flushable, which is really, really key. So those are also great things to think about because nobody likes to clean the litter box. They want to be able to flush it and get that stink out of the house. And it, so we like, like along and with it's products, biodegradable. And along with products like that, are there natural things that you can do with like household items to make Sure. A litter? Well, one of the things that you want to do is think about your grooming because you can make grooming an eco friendly experience. So, we have pure natural pet products right here, and they're USDA organic certified, which is great. They're healthy for the environment, healthy for you, and they're healthy for your pet. So, they've got a collection of conditioners, shampoos, and salves and, um, and balms, which really condition and help, you know, have produce a healthy pet without toxins, GMOs, parabens, and toxins, which is also wonderful. Next up, we don't realize that we have about 12 million small animals in this country. And one of the things that we want to do is think about what's best for them. So CareFresh makes spe uh, species-specific bedding, which is really great. And it's actually made with paper that has no toxins, no chemicals. And it's really nice because your pet, your 
hamster, your guinea pig, is going to have a nice eco-friendly experience. It's actually made with paper, which has no toxins, proprietary odor control formula, so you don't have to worry about the health of your pet. Right. And it's absorbent. And last but not least, we all need to think about what we eat, because you are what you eat. So I love this Avengers food because, actually, they source all of their ingredients made from the U.S. 50 miles from their plant. Ah. So you're basically getting All natural, chicken. all local, right. and that also, stuff. Exactly. The only thing that's not sourced is the fish. And I've actually eaten the dog food. Oh, you've and eaten it. I've eaten Fantastic. it. It's really yummy. Well, Charlotte, thank you so much. John, thank you as always. Everyone here, all the dogs. Ty, are you still awake? Ty's still, still awake. awake. All right, we put all the information on FoxFiveSanDiego.com. Click on the scene on tab. Guys, we'll send it back to you. I want the dog, the one with the blue.